Hello, I'm back. It's been two months. What the actual... I'm back again talking about Adventure Island. Oh, yes. There's a bloody surprise. But there's once again more news to talk about. And when there's news, I'm there. So, if you actually watched this channel, you might have seen a few months ago me jokingly say... Is there going to be an RMC down there? Tell me. Do you think there's going to be an RMC at Alton, uh, blah, 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 uh, Adventure Island? RMC 2025. This was obviously never going to happen, yet the Miller family are yet again investing in the park, with the Screech opening just late last year and Axis opening late 2019. But at the beginning of this theme park season, Adventure Island put on their park map that there will be a major project coming autumn of 2022. Now I did make a video speculating what I thought this may be and whether it will be a new coaster or not. And I said at the end that I didn't think that it would be a new coaster. And recent news confirms that I might have been correct. An article from June that I somehow managed to miss at the time says Adventure Island, two new rides in the pipeline as South End Theme Park plans big shake up. Now for me this just confirms the news that there will be a new major your project but i hear you asking the question what is it gonna be now it looks like adventure island are looking to install two new rides simultaneously with a big wheel and a drop tower being suggested as new rides now the park already has a big wheel as well as three drop towers which means i think that sky drop could be removed now this big wheel is going to dominate the skyline being 33 meters in height which is three meters taller than large sbf visa flat ride axis and with this new exciting attraction on the way it would not be surprising at all to see the classic big wheel of adventure island be removed now what you've all been waiting for the details on the drop tower now unfortunately we have no information on the manufacturer of the drop tower but we do know that it's going to be the tallest ride in the park standing at a whopping 38 meters tall they also mention how the drop tower will be round making me feel like it could be a fabric drop tower similar to the one detonator at fort park which i would genuinely love to see at adventure island whatever happens it's fantastic that the miller family are investing yet again into the park and i really look forward to seeing what could be this new project thanks for watching this video make sure to like and subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you next time